All right, we're here at Heathcote Raceway. I've got four cars to be engineered here today. They're, they're all getting close. They're all ready for the plates. We, the engineers need to sign off on a few more things. Not only am I going to do a bit of engineering work with these four engineers, I'm going to take blown HJ out in the pad. Have a bit of fun. Hope you enjoy. Okay, so we're out on the track at Heathcote Park here. I've got car number one, the XF. It's at the start line. I um, have with me Steve, quick rundown, who have I got? Uh, Steve Churches, uh, I'm the signatory, uh, one of the signatories here today. Uh, I've been a uh, signatory for 14 years now, coming up 15. Um, this type of uh, vehicle we do a lot of work with. Uh, so today what we're doing, we're going to first of all get this car prepped and ready for the testing. We've been out with check and track, we've done a whole new track for check for any debris or rubbish or what have you. We've done a track temperature test, we've done an ambient pressure and ambient temperature test and we've done uh, direction of wind and wind velocity which is all within uh, requirement. What we're doing now is we're checking the car for the rotor uh, heat on the rotors to begin with. We're going to take the car for a test run just to warm the brakes up and to bed them in so that we're comfortable with them. So we'll do that before we do the actual testing. The car's been weighed, we've done corner weights on the car to make sure everything's okay there. Uh, everything's balanced out well. We've got the car loaded uh, with the required weight requirements so that's ready to go so the next thing we're going to do now is we're going to take it for a couple dummy runs up the track just to warm it out and get the feel of the car before we actually do the uh, procedure on the brake testing all right that's steve's introduced we know here so that's one of the three engineers here today we'll get to meet the rest of the guys um, i'm going to get out of the way uh, sit back and see if we can learn something all right thanks steve good on you Okay, so it's car number two time, the HT wagon. I've got engineer number two, Zane. Uh, quick, introduce yourself, mate, and who you work for. Yeah, sure. Zane Jaber from Jaber Engineering Consultancy, based in Melbourne. We're here with a rod shop team assisting with the braking test under National Code of Practice. We're going to weigh the car, we're going to do some measurements and go from there. Perfect. All right, I'll get out of the way and let Zane do his thing. Five four four. Five four four. Four eighty on the front. Right, so we're here with Jesse Braybrook, machinist R and D setup man at the rod shop. Jess, thanks for the car. Yeah, no worries, mate. All right, so we've got the LS powered surf here. Now, what have the boys done? We're up to the scales. Yeah, all good? we chucked it up on the scales. Now the driver side front's heavier than the rest. That's just the steering box and battery. So, uh, yeah, we just figured that out. It's all good. All right, beautiful. So if we jump down, I'll just grab uh, Reese. You got a minute? Yep. I've got Reese here, our intern man. Um, quick rundown, your full name? Uh, Reese Bentley. So, uh, yeah, I've been working with Russell for around two years now. Perfect. And yeah, what do you so, do apart from Russell's work? Uh, I work on Jeeps for a living. So, they're quite fun actually. A lot of wiring to go through, so a bit of new technology, but mix the old with the new. Enjoy right. it a lot. So, you're always learning. What are we yeah. up to in here, mate? Uh, we're we currently setting up the load cell for the um, brake test. So, we've got to pair it with the, the new device that we've got. Yep. 
yeah. All right, all good? Yep. All right, we'll let them get back to work. All right, so not far away, we'll take this thing for a spin down the track and see what it does. Uh, three cars have officially been checked. We've got one to go. So the Barra Patrol, next down on the track. Let's see how the brake test goes. So side one, what noise did we get? About 87.3 from memory. Yep, yep, perfect. So that's all in the ballpark. Plenty, yep. plenty no, of room there. Plenty of room there. And just a quick measurement, just what you're doing here. What's the scale here? Just so the guys know at home what we're doing, how far? 500 mil. 500, and on what? On, on, a, on a five degree angle, yeah. All right, that's no, right. beautiful. All right, let him go. Three. Yep. One point six. What was that last one, Reese? Eighty three point four. Yeah, we're all the same. Yeah, pretty good. She's real bright, man. Yeah. That's literally a pass to the highest standards. Okay, so member number four of our team that's coming to give us a hand today is Russell. Full name, where are you from, Russ? Russell Roll, best you want. Right, we've got you covered officially here, mate. All right, um, so everything's going quite well today. Now, quick one, ask you a favour. We want to have a little bit of fun out here to do, but to do it safely. Can we do some checks on this? Is that we able? Well, they won't be official checks, but we will use correct you know, equipment to assess it. Yep. We can't go ahead and load the vehicle, and obviously with only a portion of the brake system working, but we'll still go ahead and give you some basics on it as well as your exhaust test, we can do that as well and weigh the vehicle and get your corner weights. All right, well look, it can only help me on the pad and God yeah. knows I need all the help I can get out there if you've seen me drive. So, all right, we'll jump out of the way. You're in the driver's seat. Yep. Happy with that? All right. I'm out of the way. Let's see how we go. Total, so 424, 381. What was that side? 365. All right, so the boys have just weighed the cars. We checked on the scales there. 1583 is our weight. I think they're about a 70 litre tank and it is full to the brim. So we'll jump out of the way, we know the weight, we'll see how it goes. The official work is done here at Heathcote Park. Um, I'd like to thank my boys in the background. Done an awesome job again today. Uh, thank their wives and children and everything else because it is close to Christmas, but they've given me another full day's work. So uh, that out of the way, to select the engineer guys, we went all the way down to Gippsland. We've gone to Geelong. We've gone to Melbourne City. We're getting from everywhere. They're a bunch of independent engineers. So shout out, boys. Thanks for today. Appreciate it. They've got a lot of paperwork to get through. Now, my boys are all waiting. Not for that. We're going to hit the pad in Blown HJ. Let's see how we go. Righto, so we're out on the pad now. Now this is where the party starts. Now we're gonna run a little bit of a motor car to set up. So we're gonna run a go to woe, the figure eight and back, 
and then we'll just make the rest up, maybe a quick track round here. Now, lay your bets between yourself of who you think and how you think they're gonna go. So car one, we have Nath out of the office. Number two, I'll jump in that one, only because we need a driver. Three, Matty jumped in the wagon because he won't let anyone else in it, the LS man. Craig's jumped in the patrol. And if any damage happens, hopefully it's a far car because it's the only one that Team Rod Shop doesn't officially own. So, Jess, all the best with you. We'll see what happens. So, we're going to run back to the start line. Hope you guys enjoy. So, what we're going to do, go to O first thing. So, we're going to shoot down. Got to stop between the two cones. Now, Chevy's the judge. He's the cameraman. He's the man to stopwatch to save the arguing. If he doesn't give me the winner, he walks home. Secondly, we're going to do a slalom. We'll set three cones up, weave in and out, do the hoop, come back, weave, land back on this end. And then finally, we're going to go up one ring around and back. Now, figure eight's out. They're two four-wheel drives, safety first. I don't want these boys on their lid. So we'll try and keep it as safe as we can, yet have as much fun as we can. Let's see how I go first. Right, so I mean, obviously that didn't go to plan. The thing's been popping and banging since we got out there. Now come off the pad, the first hit, really good. Um, and I lost it, but coming out there then after go to woe, made a few backfires and a few pops, and even idly and the boys have checked it. Uh, so it's time to get on the phone to Benny Nogas and get him off his holidays and shoot up and have a look at it before Sydney. So hopefully nothing major. I just say it's got a leak or uh, needs something with the tune done. So we'll leave that to Benny. Right, let's get a move on. Uh, XF Falcon time, we'll see if we get Nathan out, so there we go. Well, it's only fair on everyone's behalf. We opened up a little bit. Them four drives ain't going to make that. So a bit of complaining. Uh, Craig and Jesse have had a bit of a sook up there. So we'll give them a little bit of room, not a lot.
to the last event. Now there's a bit of bickering in the pits already, who's ahead? So this is gonna, I reckon, sort the men from the boys. So we're gonna start on that line. And the boys gotta go down, round and back. And the front wheel has to be on the line. I'll guide him in or out. We've gotta make sure that's on the line. This is, I reckon, gonna be the decider. So I'll guide you back and forth, you've gotta be on that line. Down, round, back. Side the winner after the footage. Thanks again for watching. Like, subscribe. See you again.